Welcome back to more Blaster Master Zero Two. In the last episode, we fought, uh, we traveled into Planet Montage, and well, we kind of destroyed uh, someone's crops by accident. Sorry about that, Gambe. But uh, yeah, we are now continuing onward with with uh, with with the rest of the planet. And by the way, since we're going to talk about this real quick. Uh, we were introduced to, two, we now know that, you know, there, there are now more MA pilots than there were before, with the, with the release of, with Gambe and her support, and his support droid, excuse me, I say her, his support droid, uh, Tay. Now here's the thing that I learned. Um, uh, after the recording, I failed to talk about this too. Um, it turns out that Gambe, along with Planet Montage, as a whole, are based off of another obscure uh, arcade title that came out in 1985 called Icky. Or Icky, basically, pretty much. So, pretty. So, in a sense, this game, what we're playing right now is a. Uh, what we saw in the last. In the boss. In regards to the boss battle, what we saw in regards to that boss battle is pretty much the mannerisms behind how they would play. So, with that being said, um, you know, there's a lot to be, there's a lot to take in, in regards to, ouch, in regards to that method. But anyway, we got, uh, map B3, so that way we can access that, we can pretty much get that one later. Uh, let me just use, a uh, Frank down here. I can't use Fred, never mind. I had to be, I had to be invisible to where, oh, okay. I had to be invisible to where I needed to switch a friend, so let's do that. There we go. Alright. So, pretty much all his attacks, all his mannerisms and whatnot, pretty much matches uh, what we know, what we see in regards to uh, the character. Now, Icky is actually a very... Uh, how do I put this? It's a very obscure game that came out for the Famicom, it came out for the arcades first in the Famicom, and it got re-released again. But anyway, uh... That's pretty much a little interesting tidbit I want to talk about. Now, as for uh, Montage as a whole, you know, the planet, everything else in between, it's like, the music sounds amazing. I mean, it's like one of my favorite tracks in the game. And, of course, we now have the, uh, with the wall jump feature that we have, it just pretty much helps us to, a re to a navigate er certain areas, just in case, you know, if we, you know, just in case we do decide to get lost by any chance. So, in a sense, oh, guns. Thank God we have this feature. Thank God we have the, the wall jumping mechanic. Ooh, okay. So, we can, okay, okay. Amazing. So, pretty much we can do is the wall jump. We have not found a map at all yet, have we? We're venturing off somewhere else, but, you know. I feel like we need, I feel like we need, I feel like we're pretty much at our bridge ran off somewhere else. But, ah, uh, I gotta be careful too. Wait. Oh, wait, I can go down underneath. I keep forgetting. Yeah. Alright. If I screwed up, we can pretty much backtrack. Which I feel like. Oh no, can we backtrack? Because there's like more items back there too. We'll see. I'm pretty sure there's more back there than, 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 than ever. So hopefully we can see more. Uh. I can't help. I can't help. I can't help but the fact they need to go back. I'm gonna backtrack later on. You know what? Or do I have to go here? Hold up. I think we can go here. Maybe we can backtrack later. Why not? We still have a lot to do in the studio. So anyway, let's we, we pretty much lost everything, as you can tell, due to our zombie fight. So now we need to get everything back. Hopefully... Hopefully it also means we get our weapons back too, so that's one thing I miss, cause, you know... I don't mind a blaster! 
But I also do mind the fact that we do need, you know, more more laser types. So far we've got two keys. I feel like, you know. Oh. Here we go. So pretty much we're in the top down view. Oh, I, that's what I was worried about. Oof. Alright. Three keys. Alright. Alright, come on. Look at this. There we go. Ow, I just lost my I just lost my thing. Well we all found a fourth key. Well you know what? I just realized something too. I haven't tried you haven't used saber, I haven't tried out yet. I died! That was a risk. Okay. Maybe that was a bad idea. Let's try that again, shall we? Alright. Let's just backtrack to the part where I uh, died. Alright, that's how it's supposed to work, by the way. That's how I actually want to shut off. Anyway, we wasted all that energy right here, so I'm going to try my best to actually recover all the stuff. Let's just get all the keys I lost back. If I could okay, so basically, so pretty much there's timing. There's, there's certain timing I'll need to see. Alright, that's what I mean, killed the last time. Oh, God! Okay, time to move. I need, I need help. I need health and badly. Here we go. Can you find- can you give me health? I got another key. Okay, I got more keys, though, so that's one thing. And I need a checkpoint, too. I just realized it. Uh, okay, I have more health, but that's good. Alright, we're back where we are, and well, as you can tell, after that blunder that I had with trying to try to show something off, which always goes wrong in my case, we're trying to recover more and more of what we've lost, we gained. So right now we have five keys. We can access no problem. Being in the water real quick, because I know I think it's easy to me it's easy for me to miss something. You're gonna be too sure, because like you could be so Oh god! That's what I was worried about. Yep, that was what I was worried about. But either way, we got we got there was a full side right there. I didn't realize it. All right, what about the left side? Oh, oh God! Yeah. The problem is I can't move fast. Enough. Okay, that was the only th that was a waste of my time then. And I run walk really slow in the water, so that was a waste of my time on my at first. Anyway. Let's venture onwards. There's more keys we can get up here. Alright. Something to be, to be said. Alright. We need this key. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. There we go. Keep this in mind. This is what we're going to be doing. In regards to uh, how we're going to fight the boss. Because we might be encountering something like that. Um, especially in the top view. Anything else I'm missing? Okay, that was a bad room. Bad room. Okay, there we go. There, okay, so we can. There's pretty much need some keys to get that map, which we can get no problem. If we can find it right here, that'd be nice. All right. Okay, I have six keys. The seventh one should be here somewhere. All right. Ah, uh, the wave gun. That's pretty much what I wanted. There we go. That one had a key. And guess what? We now have Planetoid Map C1 for Area C. Alright, so pretty much we can do whatever we want now. We only have eight keys. We can pretty much unlock everything else with, with, with that much with that amount of keys. So pretty much we got what we need. Um, I feel like this next one is going to be... Um, not a map, because I think the maps... Okay, so we need all eight keys to get that part right here. And we come up to a safe spot right here. So, we got a full... Oh, this boss right here. This is Avira. This is one of the bosses that I fought. I remember giving the hardest time, too. But you know what? This one should not be much of a problem. If, as long as you use your blast counter, like right there, 
you should be fine. So remember, use your wave, your wave, your wave button, and well, your wave button is your best friend. So there, you just get away. Ooh, that was a close call too. There's all the circles around you. Just make sure you stay out of this range and you should be good. There we go. Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, I just lost two of my there we go. Oh boy, it would be great if I had my own reserve. Oh, what's this? We got our first access key! So now we have an access key that access that is access, access key to the dimensional tunnel between area B and area C. Did we get it? Huh? That wasn't so bad. Testing. Ah, uh, ah, uh, Tay, I just thought to talk to sink. Hey, Jason, can you hear me? Gumbe, I defeated Severa. I think. I thought I told you, don't let your car down. Here's where the real fight starts. Huh? What? Jason, get back! Right now! Uh-oh. Something tells me we're not done yet. What's going on? I'm getting a signal. A boss mutant? You gotta be kidding me. Boss mutant? I already defeated Severa! Oh wait, did I screw up? Because I feel like I... That was only part, one part of Severa. Get back to Sophia! One away. Hold on. I think I jumped the gun this episode because I remember I did the same thing in the test playthrough too. Oh wait, did I jump the gun? Oh, anyway, I feel like this next one is gonna be a boss, a, a boss coming up. Yep, I jumped the gun on this one. Oops. Uh, Jason. Eve, are you okay? I can't believe it. This thing's gigantic. That's the real Zephyra. Its size isn't even the biggest problem. You see that glowing stone at the top? That's Zephyra's heart. Oh, that's a weird place to be at uh, heart, but okay. Then we just need to attack. Yep, if you hit that, the whole thing will freeze if he's in his tracks. But that's just the beginning. Then you need to go inside. There are a bunch of clones of Severa inside it. They all need to be defeated. If Severa starts moving again, you're in big trouble. It's not an enemy, it's just one MA can take on. That's how poor Kubica got done it, done the way she did. So we can't get anywhere without keeping the heart un under attack. Yep, that's what me and Gambe Okay, so pretty much I had to forgot to mention uh, in one of the notes, Gombe is actually spelled G O N B E I, in or in Japan it's basically spelled G O N B E. Here it's spelled G O N B E Y, which I'm assuming is pretty much a uh, Kansai dialect, which is pretty much replaced with a Southern American accent. If you catch my drift. That's what me and Gumbe here are all gonna do for y'all. While we do that, you need to get in and, in and defeat the clones directly. So that's the plan. Got it. Lead the clones to me. We're counting on you. We won't let it move one inch while you're inside. So this is basically our next boss battle. Gatherer. This is pretty much something we need to talk about. This boss is... So while we're at the midst of all this happening, we gotta talk to Middle Heart. Meanwhile, the could be, uh... Meanwhile... Oh, we gotta move. We gotta watch out. We gotta watch out. We gotta move and attack the Heart. Now that's done. While they're holding it down, go inside the drawer and attack it. Attack the uh, Zephyrus. First things first, what I'm gonna do. Alright. First things first. I need to find more stuff. Ah. Here we go. Come on. Here we go. Just gotta keep going. So right now, I don't have any good uh, weapon. I don't have any good uh, weapons. 
Ah. Alright, uh, press one button too. Here we go. That's what I meant to press. Oh, God. make sure he doesn't follow me. Oh, now it's gonna. Well, that's gonna stay away. Oh, can... oh, I didn't know you could do that. So you can charge and actually do your blast counter. I that's something I knew. That's... Oh, damn it. Okay, that's something I learned. Alright, there we go. So, pretty much we're almost done with the first clone. Now, in my test playthrough, it, it took me a couple tries to do so, because I died to a lot of stupid stuff in the game. So, that's pretty much something you need to watch out for. Anyway. Get back in here, do some more damage on the Gathera. And watch out for the bullcrap. Oh, that was fast. Alright, that was actually a quick one. This one, it took me a, lot, a while to do in the original, but now we're dealing with two. Now we gotta figure out, oh. Now we gotta spend time to covering, ow. Alright. There we go. Ow. So I don't want to die here, that's one thing. Because that's all my progress lost. But it's not a bad boss, I just need to... Not fall into bullcrap. Stay in the middle. Stay in the middle and you should be fine. Watch out. Here we go. We're almost done here, we just need to take care of some business. And watch your blast counter too. Watch your watch your blast counter, as well as your. Uh, let me feel for a moment. There we go. All right, so I need to be careful because I am like. All right, that's one done. That's two done. All right, that's two done so far, and we are out. Alright, let's head back out. Alright, keep. Now we gotta keep on neutralizing. So, pretty much, we gotta keep going. I'm just pressing. I'm just rapidly pressing the button right now while Gombe and Tay hold, holding it down. We'll go to the next room. So far, we have not died. I don't. Oh, God. I, and the best part about it is you can actually recover. After, you know, a certain moment. This was one of the rooms I remember doing, and... Ow. Okay. This is gonna be a bit of a trouble. Ooh. Okay, gotta be careful. I make sure I don't get caught in any of the crossfire. Oof. Alright, they're gonna do it again. Make sure. Okay, this one right here. Alright. Oh, okay, gotta be careful. Gotta be careful, gotta be careful. Oh, ow. Cause they are really closing in on me. I am running out on blaster. Oh. They're doing the nerve uh, warp. This was a good one. Oh! That's two done. That's one done. That's two done. Can we get the last one in? There we go. I lost my, all my weapons, but you know what? It was worth it. Alright. So... Let's get back in. Let's get back into, uh... Sophia. Hey, wail on him. Alright. Watch out for the- Ooh! That's right, I forgot! This is where things get- Ooh! Okay. Yeah, now it's gonna start being tricky for you. And, because I wasted- Ow. Ow. Alright. Oh, goodness gracious, gotta be careful. 
Now I gotta watch out, because we are almost... Alright, cool. Now, those green things right there are shields done by, uh... Gambe... Gambe and Tate, so they help me out with distance. This is actually the most hardest one. Okay, now I gotta be careful. Now I have, I have no ammo power. So now I gotta remember to be careful. So pretty much I can do right now is play safe. Alright, so what I gotta do is play safe. And try to not get caught. Oh god. Ah. We're almost done. Can I play safe? Alright, that's two done. That's one done. Okay. Last one's gonna be two last one last last, last counter, so that's what I'm gonna do. Alright. That last hit. Now I'll use one more blast hit, last hit. There we go. So, we got all the clones down, but we're not done yet. Oh shit, oh, I almost made the same mistake as last time. So now, we gotta finish up the last of the hits. And that's it! We defeated Gathera, and it took me one try this time! Holy crap! It's over. Gambe, you finally did it. Jason, Eve, it's all thanks to you. I'm just glad we could help. Gombe's icky has finally come to an end. Huh? I see what you did there. Gombe's icky has finally to come to an end. Play that game. Unfortunately, they still have a long fight ahead of them. That fight will be theirs alone. On this planet. We have our own fight to take care of elsewhere. Since we got the access key, we better start getting a move on. Going already? Going already? Yeah, of course. Sorry for keeping you so long. We couldn't have it done this without you. Thank you. Eve, hope you can get the help you need on Sophia. Best of luck. Thank you, Tay. Alright, time to make our way through the dimension of the tunnel. But not yet. Thank you, Gabe. We young gun pushing poor co you got you got and push go ah. I can't do I cannot work that today. Dang it, Gambe. You got you gone and pushed poor Kubica too hard and got her all roughed up again. <laughs> Don't you go laughing off now. We think it's gonna fix her. Huh? Okay. So we can leave. Well, we're not gonna be leaving, period, because there's a lot of things I missed. And plus. There's a lot we gotta take care of. So the next episode, we're gonna be doing a little bit of cleanup in this planet before we move on. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Peace.